three, four. In the Finnish language, there's a nice word. It's pelimanni, and it usually means somebody who plays folk music. But I think it works better when you sort of read the word so that it means more like an, an attitude of music making. It's a more sort of inclusive way of making music when you're a pelimanni. How does it feel? Sometimes in some repertoire, I think it's probably beneficial to stick more to the plan. But that's kind of difficult for me. <laughs> As a person, I seem to be drawn more to trying to figure out in the rehearsals what the possibilities will be in the concert of changing the flow of the music and how far can we go. So to use the rehearsal partly to agree on things and use the concert partly to blow up the things that you agreed on in the rehearsals. Black Angels puts everyone outside of their comfort zone in the beginning. It sort of becomes its own <laughs> zone. It's almost like an actor, I suppose, preparing for a role where you need to use a prop. You can't look like you're using it for the first time when you go on stage. And as a player, it puts you in a completely different existence than basically anything else that I've ever played. I don't consider myself a conductor in these projects because if everything goes according to plan, I will have my fiddle in my hands all of the time. A friend of mine called Jan Söderblom, he said once that a really good orchestra works as hard with a conductor as they would without a conductor. So to take ownership of a performance, even when there's somebody waving their hands or leading from a violin, that everyone feels they own this orchestra and they own this piece of music and this concert. And from my side at least, I think working with the SEO is one of the big rewards of being in this profession in the first place. It's a thing that you kind of, you hope to get to do one day. And the fact that I've gotten to be here so many times already is, is something that I would pat myself on the back about if I would not be Finnish. We don't pat ourselves on the back so much. Mm -hmm.